Hi, this is Matthew Robert Payne, and uh, this is just a short uh, thank you uh, message uh, from the Lord Jesus uh, to Denise. Uh, so I'll just let uh, uh, the Lord Jesus speak. Denise, um, as Matthew was contemplating uh, this video and sharing a short uh, message with you, I had him think of uh, two uh, things in scriptures that I mentioned. I was uh, allowing his mind to think of uh, the uh, the young boy that I uh, gave uh, a wait a sec. I gave him the image um, of uh, the young boy that uh, gave Jesus uh, his five barley loaves and two fish. And uh, it's barley loaves because barley loaves uh, were cheap and not as expensive as wheat. He was a poor boy, uh, but uh, he brought out a lunch uh, that uh, would sustain him for one or two days and uh, I was preaching uh, for multiple days and he had enough to sustain him uh, for one or two meals, uh, five barley loaves and two fish. And uh, he he knew that uh, I wanted to feed the crowd and uh, so he gave up everything he had. And uh, I realised that um, something that has been said by Matthew has uh, sparked you to... Uh, send like a little offering of uh, $5 uh, to Matthew's ministry. And uh, to you, that $5 might uh, seem uh, to be a lot. Uh, to some people, it's a really small offering. The other uh, thing that happened was that boy has been glorified. That story has been glorified. That boy is in glory and has be, be received praise uh, from all the people that were fed those days and he's remembered as a, a brave boy that gave all that he had and uh, I used to do a tremendous miracle. Uh, the boy is revered and remembered and gives a lot of people a lot of faith and uh, you are, are also going to be remembered by Matthew uh, for your offering. Uh, he had a um, an iTunes subscription uh, taken out of his PayPal today for twelve ninety nine, and uh, he doesn't like automatic payments that come out of his iTunes. But iTunes uh, allows him to listen to worship music and music uh, to download for free, and uh, he he needs worship music to maintain himself and uh so your payment went a little towards paying for that and it's a great gift to matthew um he can download an album or two uh, this month and your uh, payment can pay for that the second story i want to remind you of is uh, when we we're in the temple with uh, my disciples and we saw the pharisees going in and putting money in the jar out of their abundance and out of their wealth. And then we saw the widow come in with one mite and uh, put in a mite. And I said to the disciples, it doesn't seem much, but she uh, put in everything she had. She put in her last uh, bit of money and she has faith in me uh, to provide for her, but she wanted to bring an offering to God and bring her offering to uh, the the kingdom and Matthew's not aware of how much five dollars is to you whether that's a big amount or everything you have or you just wanted to test his ministry and test uh, the anointing on his ministry you wanted to uh, sow a little amount to his ministry but an amount that means something to you you mean something to me and your faith is a good faith and your faith is 
one that is pursuing me and wants to draw close to me and wants to be intimate with me. You have a great faith. And uh, that woman uh, who gave that little offering was mentioned uh, in the word of God. And uh, she was made as an example of someone who doesn't have much, but uh, has given everything they have. And uh, Matthew is often tremendously blessed by uh, small offerings to his ministry. And I just wanted to say a special word that you touched Matthew's heart uh, with your minute, uh, offering today. And he, he wants to pray that um, you find your purpose in life. And he, he prays to me that his intercessory angel prays for you that you would find uh, he, he's your purpose in his life. He's written a book called Finding Your Purpose in Christ. He encourages you to, you to spend 99 cents and download that book on Kindle and read that book. He prays that you find your purpose and uh, you move into a place of uh, understanding and being led by the Holy Spirit so you can fulfill your purpose. He prays that uh, you find happiness and joy and peace and uh, you uh, find an intimate relationship like one that he has. He prays every blessing of your life favour of your life, blessing of your life, and pray that uh, you'll be led by the Holy Spirit and directed by the Holy Spirit just as clearly as he does get led every day. You're a really special person, a very kind person, a very loving person, a very giving person, and you're a beautiful person. You demonstrate my character everywhere that you go, and I pray that uh, my words encourage you I want to encourage you to keep on pressing into me and pursuing me in intimacy, and I will uh, give you uh, the desires of your heart. God bless you, and God bless you for your gift.